shit. We gotta keep it together. Me and Brody stand up in the wild. Stack this money, we gon' get shot. Yeah. Season three. I will leave that up to y'all about whether we do it or not. And I will tell y'all the incentive for whether I do that one or not on the next video. We're coming down to the wire, so we'll see. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, subscribe if you haven't. Comment down below. Turn on the notifications button so you know when I post my videos. But that's it. Let's get into it. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you. What? It? it? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit. Arvo, we're not trying to be mean to you. We just want to know if this is where the supplies are. Is this the place you're taking us? Are the supplies here? No, it's at the house. It's still more walk. Some more hours. God damn it. I knew this was going to happen. This guy fucked us. <sighs> Thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. I think we should spend the night here, if it's safe. That's a big if. Well, there's a fence, which would help with walkers. Maybe. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Shh, it's okay. It's okay. You're natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got them. Come on over. It's safe. Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and... All it being your birthday and all, figure, this is as good a time as any. I'd like a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, what's a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. 
feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep him warm. He's a tough little guy. I can take it. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Oh, we can lit the night. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just don't know what she's getting at all this. She usually travels by herself. It has to be hard. Maybe she's just lonely. Well, that explained a few things. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Eh, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. All right. All right, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes. That, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I don't know. Maybe she likes him? No, well, I think we could bet on that. Because you see here, Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. <laughs> hey, Bonnie wanted the biggest splash too. <laughs> oh man, that is funny. They all out there on the, the walking streets. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... you know... Be around. It'll only be weird if you make it weird. Just be cool. Hang out. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? 
Wanna sit? It's okay. It just might burn a little. You'll feel it in your nose. Um, sure. <laughs> you okay? Uh-oh, busted. I better take that back. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Did you ever get caught? Yeah. The problem with glass is it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Time to not make it weird. Wanna sit here? No. That's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wherever you like. I mean, I could be quite persuasive, you know. Do my thing. Talk to Arvo. Hmm. Alright. I guess I'll go to him next. Kenny, you ain't my father. Telling me you can't, can't drink. There ain't no rules. You think you are, cuz. This is such a buzzkill. Just take the drink, man. Enjoy the rum. Get a little lit. You... Oh. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I asked you not to drink. Girl your age? It ain't right. I know you think you're older, but you're not. Of all the things I've done, that I've seen, I really don't think it's a big deal. Yeah, I'm sorry. You're right. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. It's a nice night. Just, uh, needed some air. Kenny. There's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there. After Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help. And I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You... you really hurt my feelings. I did my best, and... I know. I was just... in darkness. And you showed up... with some light. But I thought I needed to stay there... a little longer. When I should've went with you. Okay. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. 
I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Doesn't Fuck. there. A lot for a couple years. Good riddance. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Katja's face. I really liked Katja. She was one of the nicest people I've ever met. She had a big heart. To get it broken like that, it was too much for her. It should have been too much for me. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. The baby might be cold. Maybe you should bring him by the fire. Yeah, okay. Damn, I'm good. Look at that. I knew bringing in the baby would for sure convince him. It'd be over. It's over. <laughs> uh, Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. <laughs> All right, enough of that. Hey, you clam. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah, we need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. He needs it as much as anyone right now. It's a nice thing to do. I said my piece. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. And they do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So I think it's best Leave to... Leave me alone! Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have... Leave me alone! It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow. Yeah. That's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really. I, uh... Don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. Typical Kenny. Just killing moods. Arvo's old crew did just get, you know, murked. But you sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I... If I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think <gasps> you're full of shit. Look out! There's a walker! What the fuck? Ah! 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 Jesus Christ!
That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere! That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. You gotta be on your toes on when you out here. My man's just sitting there chilling, you know. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. Is there any other way to get there? Do we have to cross the lake? I should have stuck to the tree line. The fastest way between two things is a straight line. It's not far. Just be on the lookout. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't come together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out, just to be safe. Less weight, the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. That's their idea of not clumping together? Are you serious? Oh, this is bad. This is very, very bad. This joke. No, this this ain't spreading out. Oh, I can see it now. We're okay. Don't worry. We got some walkers behind us. Well, it's only a few of them. We should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. That's two less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Uh, Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't run! Well, they made it. Don't come over here. My man's just dead leg in it. Yeah, hey, I can too make much it. Weight. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help it's too you. Too thin for both of us. I just. Just gotta be careful. Oh, stop, no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine! I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out! You gotta get out of there, Luke! Yeah, Clem! I'm working on it! You need to help! No! Clem, you're go! Fall through. Go help no, him! No, Clem, Clem, do not! Just go back for him! You're lied! You stop can do telling it. her that! Clem, look at me! Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Claim you can make it, but you need to go. Thanks. Thanks. I'll be out in a sec. Just, just keep shooting. You're not gonna be. I, 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 I'm on the leg. I just, I just Hold need on, him. I got you. Rest a sec. Uh, keep him off us, No, man. no, it's too much. Too Shut much up. Weight. Shut the f Bonnie, no! Oh my. Why would you. you we. Luke! 
It's too late. Clementine, stop! Nothing more you can do! Oh! Let's go. I got you. No. I got you. Come on, come on. Come on. You're gonna be okay. Go to the house. We need a fire. Oh, fuck. She's gonna fucking freeze to death. Typical. How the fuck did that happen? There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. We have to get the morn. They're gonna freeze to death. He's just gone. Looks fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. God damn it. The ice. It was too thin. I just. Once that ice started to go, there wasn't nothing any of us could do. You could have. You could have helped him. Don't listen to her, Clem. This ain't on you. You son of a Helped. bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny, don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault! The hell it ain't! Kenny has a point. This is crazy! What? Because your friend here turned out to be a shitbag after all? He's just a scared kid! This ain't on him! Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks! Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too! What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit, Kenny! Fuck you. You mother! Fuck you! Fuck, Kenny! Piece of shit! your taste for this sort of thing? What did you do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help How is baby? beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Got a light. I thought I had matches. You kept it. We should have went around the ice, man. You can't have somebody dead legging it across thin ice. Come on, cuz. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. 
Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Just give me a minute. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. Kenny out here beating kids. Yes, I ain't talking about no belt. My man's got them hands. Hmm. Our boat y'all like went like that though. Man could do a punch or something. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch. But he taught me respect. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. We're all just tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. All right, give it a turn. So close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's gotta be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? I've never been there. I went once, a long time ago, just before I met Ken. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! <sighs> we'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl.
Hmm. Yeah. Well. That's uh. I don't even know, man. Kenny, typical Kenny. Just acting crazy. Figures. Busted. Yeah, and Luke, Bonnie better not be like, you should have saved him. What was I going to do to fall? Sink? The ice just would have broke anyway. And then I would have been. Ugh. Same outcome, What are you man. all? I just wanted to see how you were. <sighs> how do you think? It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. What? How stupid is Bonnie? How stupid can you be? How can I save somebody who's already cracked on the ice? What? I... Oh! You know what? Bonnie should have drowned too. She out there pulling a kitty. Well, I'm done with her. These people think they could just be all disrespectful. And just get away with it. I don't forget. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! Oh. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice, pretty wife. But then all this happened. And one day, he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. You might be right. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. You wanna try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <coughs> it puked. It puked. Gross. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near D.C. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. So we made it? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. Works? What I tell you. 
So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, this is fucking nuts. Jane's right. We should head south. We're going to freeze to death up here. And it's the best thing for the baby. I vote we go back too. Mike? Sure. Whatever. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arvo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got loot killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! You can't just walk away from us! You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Typical. I'm the one who has to talk. Man. God what is damn it. God damn it! That stupid fucking... Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem. Sorry, just... Give me a second. Close the door. What was that back there? I expected more out of you, Clem. You know, I only want what's best for that child. How could you embarrass me like that? You're scaring me. Scared? What's there to be scared about? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. Maybe he shouldn't have. Don't you say that. I ought to slap you. You know what he sacrificed for you? What I did? That means something, damn it! Kenny, you ain't did <sighs> nothing. You sat back and was like, I ain't going. I wish Lee was here. You mother. What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat with those people at dinner, well, I knew you were growing up. And yeah, I felt sad, but also pride. Pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. 
There have to be folks doing better than us. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. So we gotta be ready. Well, I'm in it off there, guys. Oh, I had to make sure to stress out a little bit. So next episode, I can make sure it ends if it's not a two-hour episode. Hopefully, there's only, I don't know, an hour, hour 15 left. So I can just knock it out in one last final episode. Because what I don't want to happen is I cut it at, say, 30 minutes, 45 and next thing you know, the final episode is 15 minutes, you know. Don't want that to happen, so. I'd rather be safe than sorry. So, yeah. But, uh, that's it for that. Rest in peace to Luke. Bonnie, we gonna have some problems now. You just, you, yeah, we got some problems. Wellington, I'm not gonna lie, I don't think it's the best idea. I think they're just gonna freeze to death, honestly. Get the Wellington and it just be nothing there. So, you know. And the whole what was, what was Shawty going? And hey, Lee would be alive if, you know, if Clem ain't run and he got bit trying to look for her. That it's ridiculous. But hey man. Lee Lee was a trooper. Lee was definitely my favorite character. He got things done. So, shout out to everybody who's still alive. Luke, I think it was just your time, bro. I don't think there's anything we could have done. Mm. What do y'all think? Y'all think if I would have tried to save Luke, I would have actually been able to save him? Hmm. You, you, you tell me in the comment section below, because I'm not convinced. I see... I go over there, try to help him. I fall through the ice anyway. And, we'll, you know, that's that's kind of bad. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not going to die. Because I'm Clementine. I got to survive until the end, right? But I can't, you know. He was right there in my sight. You know, I covered. I killed all the walkers and everything. But he just, he just... It's like Clement, he didn't go for him. He just looked at her drown. I mean, he could have did a little CPR or whatever. But, I mean, it is what it is. Rest in peace to Luke. But, that's all I got for y'all today. Um, episode... The final episode will most likely be posted... The end of this week. Yeah, the end of this week. But, like, so turn on notifications and then you'll know for sure. Um... Anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. It's your boy Phoenix 2 Free. Hope y'all enjoyed the rest of y'all week. I'll see y'all in the next episode.